Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get the Apple Visual Intelligence feature in any iPhone. I'm using iPhone 11 to show you how you can do that. You can use any iPhone to get this feature like iPhone 7, 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, any one of that, right? So first of all, uh, let me show you. As you guys can see, I have installed uh, this thing in my phone and what this thing do, how you can get this. So uh, this as you guys can see here you can check out the app icon right so how this thing works so let me show you so if I open this it directly opens the uh, AI feature like in the iPhone 16 we got the dedicated camera button to open this right so but we don't have any dedicated button on any other phone so as you guys can see here both things are getting open in the same way if I click a photo here like for this and for this we got same results as you guys can see here we got same results with Google so this is pretty quick as compared to this so as you guys can see here both same both give me same results so how you can use this trick in your iPhone how you can get this 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 is not a single way to use it I have set it on double tap that I can use it on a double tap right so if I just click twice at the back of my phone one two it opens the same thing uh, sometimes it doesn't check, you know, the back tab. It don't? What the hell? I think, okay, it works now. So this is the whole simple thing. Uh, I have also set it on my uh, assistive touch right there. So if I just long press on this one, my uh, Google app will be open and this will open the Google lens. So how cool is this? How you can set it? So first of all, you have to open App Store and search for an app and download the Google app, right? So there you go, Google. You have to download this application in your phone. After installing it, search for uh, shortcuts app there. As you guys can see here, here is the shortcut app. Open this one and here create the new shortcut. I'll create an all new shortcut for you, right? So uh, here you have to select the open app there. As you guys can see here, open app, click on this one. And here you have to choose the application you wanna open. So as we have already downloaded the Google app, you have to download the Google, right? I mean, you have to select the Google. So here you can rename it. So I'll I'll give the name to it uh, 11, 112. I'll, I'll give the name it, right? And click on done. As you done, now click on these three dots. And now uh, click on the share icon and click on add to home screen. Here you can choose, uh, here you can rename it. Here you can choose any particular photo. Click on choose photo and you can uh, set any photo to shortcut there, right? Click on choose and click on add. You almost done with your C. You got the application icon there. Now jump to settings and in the settings find here accessibility in the home page of settings. In the accessibility you can find here touch and swipe up all the way down and you will see back tap. And with the back tap you have to select double tap and swipe up two shortcuts there. As you guys can see here here is my shortcut 112. I'll choose it. So there you go. So whenever I'm just clicking twice at the back of my phone, it will open the Google Lens. I mean the visual intelligence. I can directly open the visual intelligence by clicking on this shortcut, right? So the both are same thing. I can set it with the assistive touch. So it's totally up to you how you wanna set it. So with the assistive touch, you have to click on touch and then go to assistive touch settings here, right? And now here you guys can see it shows double tap long press. Uh, you can set it on long press. So uh, just swipe up and you can choose your shortcut 112 as I already said, right? So I can just simply long press on this one and it will open the same thing, right? So there are three different ways you can do this. I hope you guys find this trick helpful. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Thank you so much.